Lady Louise Windsor, at just 20, stands on the brink of redefining her role in the British royal family. Her potential entry into the military marks a bold departure from tradition and hints at a transformative era for the monarchy. Could she be the key to merging royal heritage with modernity? Before we continue, please subscribe for the latest news about the British royal family. Lady Louise's military aspirations are not just a personal ambition, but a continuation of her family's storied history. Her father, Prince Edward, briefly trained with the Royal Marines, while her uncle, King Charles III, boasts a distinguished military career. Another uncle, Prince Andrew, served as a Navy helicopter pilot during the Falklands War. This legacy of service provides a powerful backdrop for Louise's ambitions, potentially making her the first female royal to serve in the military since Queen Elizabeth II. Reports suggest that Louise's interest in the military is deeply personal, not merely a nod to family tradition. Her active involvement in the Army cadets and her pursuits at the University of St. Andrews Officers Training Corps signal a genuine passion. Her LinkedIn profile reveals interests in military careers, diplomacy, and law, suggesting a future where she might play significant roles in both the military and the royal family. Speculation is rife that Prince William might entrust Louise with a significant role as he prepares for his future as king. While the specifics remain uncertain, her role could involve representing the monarchy at public engagements, akin to the supportive roles played by Queen Elizabeth II's cousins. This potential elevation highlights Louise as a valuable asset in the royal support system. Expert opinions reinforce the idea of Louise's growing prominence within the royal family. Royal commentator Danielle Stacy notes that Louise is carving out her own career and could become a key ally for Prince William. Royal historian Gareth Russell suggests that even without a formal royal title, Louise might be given patronages or quasi-official roles, further embedding her within the royal framework. Louise's ascent comes amid ongoing scrutiny of other royal family members, notably Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, whose public actions have sparked considerable debate. In contrast, Louise's quiet emergence seems a calculated effort to reinforce the monarchy's presence, offering a fresh, uncontroversial face for royal engagements. Both Prince William and King Charles III aim to streamline the royal family, and incorporating younger figures like Louise could prove beneficial. Her involvement could invigorate royal initiatives, ensuring continued public engagement and support for various causes. As younger members become pivotal players, the monarchy might enter a new phase of public interaction. Currently, neither Louise nor her younger brother, James, the Earl of Wessex, holds formal royal titles. However, their roles within the monarchy could become more defined as they mature. Anticipation builds around their potential contributions, signaling a shift in how the royal family operates both publicly and privately. Lady Louise Windsor is uniquely positioned to bridge tradition and modernity within the royal family. Her military aspirations honor her family's past, while her potential roles could symbolize a forward-looking approach to royal duties. This blend of respect for tradition and modern responsibility could redefine the royal presence in the 21st century. As Lady Louise navigates her future, her commitment to military service and the evolving structure of the royal family suggests she may soon emerge as a significant figure in British life. Her journey is just beginning, but her trajectory offers a glimpse into a potentially transformative role within the monarchy. Louise exemplifies a blend of dedication, tradition, and modernity that could shape the future of the British royal family.